morning. It's Friday, May the 20th, and this is the day before we leave for the CV show. Me, Tom and Millie have agreed that we're going to vlog the build up to it for you guys so you can see what goes into one of our shows. And it's now 5.13am on the Friday and I'm heading into the office because it's the final day to get stuff together so we can load it onto the van or into the van so I should say. And if I sound croaky it's because it's 5.13am. See you in a bit. One of the reasons I like to get in early the day before the show is so I can check all of the important paperwork. Important paperwork. The paperwork that I think is important. Things like vehicle passes, exhibitor passes, delivery passes. So some, many of you may not be aware, but when you turn up at the NEC, you can't just turn up and drive your van to, or the truck or whatever, to your stand. You have to book a, a slot. This one's for Monday. It gives you the time you have to be there, how long you get to unload. And um, if you go over that, they charge you as well. So we have to make sure we have everything in line. You have to make sure you've got the reg of the vehicle so you know what's going on. And then these things here, these exhibitor parking permits, if you're an exhibitor, that means that you can park on site for free for the duration of the show. And also these are our exhibitor passes that we have to wear to get in and out of the halls. That's both on the build-up days, so Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and for the show, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday as well. So uh, yeah, so get in, check through this, and then the next thing to check is to ensure that everything is loaded that we need to take to the show. First time ever actually ready early. Tim's ready, got the van loaded. Millie's here, I'm not sure what she's doing, but she's here. I'm Dusty Dirty. Dusty all good. Dusty Dirty could be your new nickname. <laughs> <laughs> Dirty. Yeah, so make sure you come and see us. We're in Hall 5, 5 E110 is the stand number. Just by the cafe. Just by the cafe. Millie was like, that's the only line I want to say. Just by the cafe. I mean. <laughs> Everyone will remember that. We've got, uh, we've got tea, we've got biscuits, we've got a sofa we can come see the new CFDs. There is a few other little tricks in that Tim's got up his sleeve. Um, but all oh, welcome, come say hi. Look forward to seeing you. See you soon, guys. Bye. Morning, guys. Saturday, 21st of May, and we're on the way to the NEC. We were supposed to vlog on the way to Cuda to pick up the van and the truck. Completely forgot. Um, sorry about that, Millie. My bad. But Tom's behind in the truck. I am sat still, by the way. I'm sat at a service station. <laughs> um, he's a few miles behind. So I've pulled over for a cheeky bacon bap. Don't tell Tom until he sees this video. And uh, yeah, we're on the way, everything's loaded and we should hopefully be in Birmingham around 11, 12 o'clock. Um, we can get the truck washed, which I can't wait to show you the truck. And then we're going to be on our way into the hall for 2 p.m. to drop the truck on the stand. Uh, we'll meet the stand builders before then as well. And hopefully we'll get some footage of how an exhibition is before it all gets built up. So yeah, anyway, till then, we're going to enjoy my bacon bap. Enjoy my peppermint tea, hottest peppermint tea in the world. Just burnt my hand on the cup, and uh, yeah, anyway, see you in a bit. Hi, guys, um, I'm gonna be in trouble with Millie. I forgot to do the morning's vlog, but uh, it's just because I wanted to. Oh, I got covered in snow. Oh, well, that's a giveaway. Well, let's try that again and try not get soaking. Anyway, good run up here, I'm not gonna grumble. Renault was lovely to drive, nice and easy. Look at that. All the soap suds. Looking good. I think he's deliberately getting me wet though. I'm doing it again. Oh man. Right. So, Tim's in the, uh, Tim's already in there. They've already got the van in. Once I'm done, I've then got to go drive over the back there. And they reckon they're going to get us in here early. So that'd be good. So, um, yeah, quite looking forward to getting in there and trying to remember what it's like from all the years ago before COVID and what it's like. Yeah, look at that. It's looking better, isn't it? I'm glad he's doing it. 
bit forever to do it if I was doing it. Chuck's had a bit of a scrub. A bit better, isn't it? Shiny. Nice and neat. Also got the uh, little electric van. Different. But yeah, mirror shield, shining bright. Side skirts looking lovely. Catwalk, nothing oh, shiny. It's all good. We're just now waiting for our turn to be allowed into the unit or into the big building. Now yeah, let's do a let's do a scenery shot so you know where you are. There you go. There's the resort well. Mountain over the back there, or a hill over the back there. Lovely country. And the A45 there. All good. Happy days. Happy to be here. Happy to get inside and then show you what's going on on the stand. So we're still waiting in the queue. A little person here, because he could go quicker than me. Yeah, I know. He stopped for a bacon roll and hasn't even brought me one. And the worst bit is he goes, oh, I said ones which are in tinfoil, which are lovely and healthy and all that. It's all lies. I just. Look, you can see I need another one. Shocking, isn't it? 54 miles an hour I was stuck doing coming here. 54, and he goes past me and waves with a bacon roll hanging out with gobbo, I expect. Yeah, pretty much, actually. Shocking. <laughs> so that previous clip where you were just seeing where uh, Tom was whinging that I hadn't, he hadn't had a bacon roll and I had, he's just texted me and said, bring food, I'm hungry. I've had to leave him unfortunately out waiting for our slot to bring those vehicles in we were hoping to get in a bit early um but one thing with the venue and led to another and we can't which is fine you know you have to be patient at these things and there's a system in place for a reason so that's absolutely fine apologies about the wind try and shield you there a little bit and uh so yeah so i've taken our van back out to one of the car parks for now and uh I'm now walking back into the hall where the stamp builders are cracking on. And then we'll see what, see what the next hour brings. But I've got to bring Tom food, so I'll see if I can find him an apple or a banana or something. And a juice box. <laughs> this truck here, which is one of these, there's no problem. But we've got him well trained, look. He's bringing me lunch because I think he feels a little guilty. But not only that, he doesn't, he doesn't know, but I've tuned it. So, been watching telly for the last half hour. Ha, truck life, eh? Good times. Well, guys, we've turned up, and our stand is very handily inside this door. And here it is. Raised floors down already, all the electrics in. So, you have your mains coming up in the middle of the stand, and then we have all of our offshoots where we want them. And they put down this protective film over the carpet make sure it's all protected when you're building stand builders have just gone for a break and uh yeah that's where we're at i'll update you in a bit so i literally just brought the truck in and the van now on the stand looking lovely lovely And behind me is the main structure being built as we speak. Hey, how cool is that? So the way I'm walking now is the way you come in from the main gate. So if you're coming to see us, you'll see literally that like that, and then the coach stand behind. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Just quick one, just in the truck, just turn the lights off because I just thought I'd show you that the LED strip which is in the uh, lockers. Look at that. That looks smart, doesn't it? Nice and bright down there for when you're uh, having a lay down. But if you look, that's neon, which means 
I end like dazzling, like little short little LEDs. That's just one strip of LED all the way through. It's quite cool, that. Yeah, it is. There's no other light on in there. It is just our light on the bottom, bottom of the locker. You can see the bottom of them seats, the back wall, as clear as anything. That's a nice ambient light, that. Don't that look smart? Other than the dirty window. Look all right, that, don't it? Happy days. All right, just a quick one, right? Drive up here. I, I used to have a Mondo many years ago, company car, and that had heated and aircon seats. Now, I haven't seen that in a long time, right? That is on the lowest setting. That's aircon for your driver's seat. It literally froze my bum. I did try it on it, but yeah, that was a bit extreme, and I'm not a fan of heated seat, but that's quite cool. But, I don't know. Don't know how many trucks have that these days, but I just, you know, I thought that's pretty awesome, you know. Aircon and heat, retro, but love it. I think it's such a good idea. Yes, I know, I know, but small things, eh? Small lines. <laughs> End of the day. Ah, at last. Let's get it done. <laughs> that's it. Day one, we've got a beer. It's been a long one, but it's been very productive. Um, Stan's coming on well. So yeah, it's been good. And uh, we're gonna have this and we're gonna find some dinner and we will see you in the morning. Say bye. Night. <laughs> Sunday, May 22nd. The next morning from when you saw the last clip, whatever that was. <laughs> Showered. Now we're gonna go meet Tom for some breakfast and then we're back over to the hall. It's 8 a.m. We're back over to the hall and uh, we're going to crack on getting some of our product on the wall on the exhibition stand with the help of the stand builders. So that's exciting because once we get, it's nice to have a, a stand with loads of graphics. Sorry, I just put my shoes on. Nice to have a load of um, graphics on a wall and stuff and they look great, but it really makes it your own stand when your product or our product goes on the wall. So can't wait to see that. Um, we've got loads of mirror shield, cab store. We actually put a truck shift microwave within a wall last night. Um, so we did that already, I haven't showed you that, but we'll show you that today. Uh, get the TVs up and yeah, let's just see how the day goes. There's lots to do still, but hopefully it's all gonna come together today with one more day tomorrow to finish everything off. Right, I'll see you in a bit. Morning guys. Morning. So we're all fed, breakfast all done, let's wander. We've both had a full English, a little few extras. How many pastries? <coughs> the, 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 the queue was big, so I had to eat a pastry as I waited. Look, Tim's got his herbal tea. It's not herbal, it's peppermint. Peppermint tea. Ooh. So, yeah, we're all good. We're now walking back to the stand. To, uh, well, the, the guys should now be there. It's still very early, as you can tell us no one about. But um, yeah, it's gonna be a good productive day again. The sun's trying to come out, so we're all good. Have a good day. See you in a bit. Sneak preview. Oh, he's doing a good job there, isn't he? Tim, you missed a bit. What? You missed a bit. <laughs> Pleasant as ever. Bless him. Don't trip over. Yeah, I try not to. <laughs> there we go. Main plinth is going in for the tread safe yeah. catwalk. Looking good. It's quite a big piece, and to be fair, the catwalk, which you can see on the floor here, we obviously got a nut it all the way down to the top of that, just so it uh, stays safe and secure for when people are about. So you can see we've also got one of the bars is now in as well. Lights up on the CUDA signs. It's looking good. Big wedge of cheese.
Little update, guys. Quick tea break. Got me a uh, got Formula One on on my phone. Packet of bourbons. Top job, that. We do really well. Tom's doing his uh, cleaning duties on the mirror shield. I'm working hard, clearly. I do work. I'm not, you know. Um, what else have we done? Oh, we've uh, set the cooler up. The NLB cab cooler. I keep looking at the wrong end of the phone for this camera. I'm on Tom's phone rather than mine. So, uh, yeah. We've um, organising the store. We've got bits, drinks, food, all that sort of stuff. That's where those bourbons came from. They're for the show. Technically, it's the show, so I'm having bourbons. Simple as that. <laughs> anyway. Oh. Oh, Verstappen's knee past Russell. Russell's going back. Come on, Russell. Come on. Come on. Oh, this is tight. Russell's still ahead of him. Come on. Hello. Right, so the guys who set up the show have now just left us. God, I am looking rough anyway. Never mind. I've had a shave this morning. I'm just, yeah. Anyway, so the guys are now done. Honestly, it's, it's painful. <laughs> it's really painful. So they have done. We've now got the mirror shields up. As you can see, we've got the egg. Uh, oh, yeah, it's very, very nice. We've got the cam shield, got the vans, and all that on there. Don't get me wrong, still need polishing. Let's quickly go for a wonder. Sorry, I'm getting sick to see my face, I'm sure. Brochure holders, one for each one, obviously. You can do this. Yeah, I know. Don't, don't look at the top of it. Cab store, the corner locker, and obviously the full size one as well. We've obviously got the TVs, but the TVs can't put up till tomorrow, just in case they go walkies. So, and then up here. Obviously, got tread safe, that's all on. Uh, some more brochure holders, this time for the truck chef. Let's go with the uh, truck chef side. This is one of the CDFs, we've obviously got the table in, USB and that all in there as well. This is Sunday afternoon. We have now got to do a severe amount of cleaning, ready for the team tomorrow to come up with then the roof spoiler and the final bits and then getting TVs and that on the wall. So I think we're all good. You're happy? happy. He's happy. Speak to you in a bit. Morning guys, it is Monday, May 23rd, 23rd, uh, me and Tom have just had some breakfast and uh, we're then, the, uh, Millie, Andy and James are on their way, they're only about 10 miles away now with the rest of the show stand exhibitions, which is great, so we're going to finish up here, wander over to the, the show halls and meet them and then crack on with the day and get the rest of the stand finished, and hopefully in about 10 hours time show you a finished exhibition stand and i was all knackered going back to the hotel for a rest <laughs> there you go anyway if you I don't know you should all subscribe to our um our email list so thank you if you do and if you don't subscribe but if you did subscribe did any of you spot millie's deliberate mistake on this saturday's email it was about air horns i've got my ipad here so i can show you if you scroll down Oh, look, we've nearly invented a new size of Hadley air horn. 27.5 inch. It's actually a 37.5 inch. It says it there in the little bit. She didn't get it right on the top though, did she? That's a shame, Millie. Really. Just called her out on YouTube. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It is 10 to five in the morning. I am just grabbing my final pieces to head to the CD show to meet Tim and Tom. Um, and we will be on the road to the CV show. I don't think I've been up this early in a very long time. But the office is so quiet. But yeah, we are on our way to meet Tim and Tom. Well, I've nicked her phone because mine's flat. But <clears throat> she has arrived at last. Better later than ever, eh? So, we'll just quickly, quickly have a wonder. They've had a really good drive up here, which is awesome. And the best bit is, they're now trying to sort the forklift out, so we've got, well, fingers crossed it will go to plan, we've got a heck of a good start, because it's gonna be a mental day today. If you saw the rest of this place, 
Okay. I'm not going to go close because it's not a pleasant view we've got, but the, the van is there and it's now being untangled, unloaded. So it's, it's now arrived. We've took Millie to a hotel room. What's the view like out of your hotel room? <laughs> we've, got, we've got Andy uh, now bringing up the carpet for us. So that's all coming along nicely. James, and I mean, I've never seen so much valet and stuff in my life, but he loves it. Uh, we've got shiny wheels going on now. Oh, lovely jubbly. Yeah. Looking good. So it's in. Oh yeah, I've got some TVs up now as well. I'm also pretty. 65 and 43 inches. Don't get me wrong, they're not they're not playing yet, but that one's got the old strand stuff going through. And the Indel B and that and a bit of everything. We've got around this side. Oh, we've still got to put that one up. I'll tell you what, that's what I'll do next. Do that one. Oh, this one's up and running. Oh look, old famous Tim. People will be standing on there later for autographs, I reckon. And Tim's just gave me 20p. I think it came out of your pockets. Oh, wicked. Makes a change. Kids normally have that. Millie's still awake. You fell asleep down there? No, she's just plugged for herself. so uncomfortable. <laughs> Been a bit of a mental day today, because it's the last day, so apologies, I haven't done much. And Tim once again on the TV. Oh, and look, there's Tim in real life. Hello. So it's looking neat. Do vlogception. Vlogception. <laughs> so yeah, joking aside, other than the final vacuum, I know it's late in the afternoon, but other than the final vacuum, I think I can safely say we're pretty much there, which is all good. But it's pretending to work. Oh no, it's going to have a quick selfie, look. Are you talking to yourself? <laughs> so everyone, you know Tom was moaning that I asked him to vlog. Look who now loves vlogging. How the tables have turned. <laughs> <laughs> right, so I don't think I'm going to get a chance to do another one today because it is going to be a mad rush again to finish up the last bit. So I'm going to say I'll see you tomorrow in something I don't normally wear. A shirt, a pair of trousers, and shoes. I know, that's shocking for everyone. So um, yeah, I even, um, even treat you to a shave. Have a good evening all. Look at him, he's looking suave, isn't he? Oh yes, <laughs> it is, what are we on? We are on Monday evening. The rain is here though, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know what time it is, six-ish. 10 to six. 10 to six. It is a uh, yeah, a little bit wet here today. We have got Millie Accom accompanying us for this evening's dinner. We've got go W H Smiths. Forgotten a few bits for the show. Um, well, not forgotten. Just some ideas we've had since we're there. So we're just going to quickly go get it there and get a couple of bits. So we're all prepped, ready for the morning. We've got 
a couple of people meeting us at eight in the morning. First doors, open doors. So Tim's meeting one set of customers and I'm meeting another set. I'm bringing two sets, oh, sorry. I was just gonna say I'm bringing two sets of shoes tomorrow, just in case my feet hurt. Just to let everyone know. This is my vlog, not yours. Get on your own. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so as soon as the doors open, we are straight on it. So apologies if tomorrow might be a bit slack, but we'll do our best to... This vlog will finish tomorrow. No, it will No, positivity. No, Oh, no, no, it will finish tomorrow because we're going to start a new one. Yeah, Tim is correct. For once. For once. For once. Nice speaking to you anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it by myself in my corner like normal. Anyway, there's the view of the lake, look at that. That's the resort world we're now going to. I am the view. <laughs> and, that, and that very, very actually, I'll tell you what, we will do another vlog in a sec, because that very, very top building is what we're now going to. So I reckon the view from there will be pretty epic, even though it is a bit moist today. Cool. Ciao for now.